California has passed legislation allowing transgender inmates in the state's correctional facilities to be assigned housing based on their gender identity. We were very nervous, angry. We weren't given a voice. No one asked us how we felt about this. No one did. In September, California Governor Gavin Newsom signed Senate Bill 132 into law. As soon as the transfer started, there were people having sex on the yard, in the porta potties. We're getting the predators, the sexual predators, people who have been incarcerated for rape, um, men who have been incarcerated for oral copulation, men who have been incarcerated for crimes against women. California now joins Connecticut, Rhode Island, New York City, and Massachusetts in recognizing inmates' gender identity. They were like kids in a candy store because they knew they were going from a men's prison to a female's prison. If this doesn't constitute bigotry, I don't know what does. Women's safety, their mental health, overall well-being, everything has been compromised. And if you're purposely putting a predator amongst prey, so to say, I don't got to tell you what's going to happen. Honestly, I really don't think the public cares.